Good afternoon, my name is Paul Riley and I'm a senior in the politics department here at Princeton University. And today on this beautiful Friday afternoon, I'm happy to be at Higher Tigers Meetup, a new alternative career fair put on by the Office of Career Services. Higher Tigers Meetup is truly an alternative career fair. When you're walking throughout the tent, you can see companies from a broad array of industries. So you have so many opportunities for students to really challenge and reimagine what it means to have a career outside of Princeton. Today's event turned on its head many of the assumptions underlying the traditional job fair model. We held it outdoors in an informal setting and we involved alumni and employers in new ways and there was a sense of genuine exploration and serendipitous conversations happening all around us. There are bistro tables where you can walk up to alums and really learn about their career path, how they ended up where they did. You can see how they took the unconventional routes and that's really encouraging for someone like me who as a senior, doesn't have everything figured out. The event was designed from the ground up with deep input from the students. They helped us challenge the assumptions of the traditional job fair model. The panel discussions brought out tremendous insights on things like whether your major is connected to what your career opportunities will be. Being a religion major, I probably have a major that most people won't have when I'm applying for jobs. What type of specific things would you say you look for? We all know that you don't have to be a theologian if you major in religion. You don't have to be a book editor if you major in English. I can kind of um, separate myself as showing my sense of curiosity, my willingness to follow my passion as opposed to what I'm supposed to do. I was wondering if you guys have any opinions on starting somewhere else. Like yes. I'm from Chicago. Uh, Chicago is the first, you yeah. know, the theater um, scene is great there. If you're in love with the process, as David said, you really can't fail because if, it does, if the show doesn't go on to the next step or et cetera, at least you've had that experience. If you work on something uh, for the wrong reasons and it doesn't work, then what do you have? That's also about it being a career. If that's the reason that you will do this because you love doing it. The organizations told us that they felt more visible and able to engage in better conversations. The alumni told us that this was a great venue to share their journey and their stories with the students. And the students told us that this was a great and informal way to make connections and personally explore what meaningful work means to them. I think what made this event so special was the way that all of us, students, alumni, employers, and career services, came together as one community to create something extraordinary for the student experience.